So what are we up to? Looks like oh, more shit work. More cleaning. Oh, that's nice. Wow. I think a lot of people figured we weren't going to do this. I think a lot of us figured we weren't going to be doing this. Today's job is just more cleaning. We're going to clean all of this and then we're going to... Well, then we're going to clean the valves. And then we're going to lap the valves in. And then we're going to clean everything again. And then we're going to put it back together. Is that the plan? I think. Uh, I it's roughly think the plan. So. Okay. All right. Well, I'll get started on the valves then because uh, it's a it's a nice evening. What better thing to do? Oh, that's perfect. That's all we yeah, need. That's light. Nice. That's, that's step perfect. one. Now we go in for the what, tighter the, the fit. Fine, just the fine finish. Wow. That's going to work out really well. It's almost like they're made for that. Yeah. Rust buster. Rust buster loosens rust. Well, I don't think that we could find a better time or place for this. Does it say valve guides? I'm rating it a 10 because <laughs> it's, it's, it's here. It's in my uh, head. <laughs> it's what we've got in front of us. If we do that and the valves, they're good. It's all good. Just having a look. Looks like they're all that free. One's, well, that one's pretty rough. That one's, that one's pretty rough. That was one that wasn't seized. That one's okay. That one's okay. That one's... It's fair. It's poor. It's poor. Ooh, that one's crusty. Did you clean that one yet? Yes. Okay. Look at how crusty your valve is. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna give her a quick wipe here. It's still a little tight. Yeah. Okay, well I'm going to clean the valves and then we're going to lap everything back in. I'm not, not getting fancy. Yeah, this whole process is getting a little fancy on this car. Oh, I like when you chip the little lead plates off into your eye. Late night Packard update. Doo doo. Agent 7899 has really gone the extra mile here. He's going to just finish the last uh, four or six ports or whatever's left to clean. And then we're going to carry on cleaning the lifter galley, the surface of the block, and the cylinders and pistons themselves. So, is there everything you hoped your day would be? This is really my life. You knew that when you first stepped into this place. Yes. Oh, you're getting back to the office here? Ah. This is this is nice. This is ergonomic. This is ergonomic type of It's not bad. Not now that you have your nice cushion there. So where are you at? Couple to go? Um, Three to go. No, it kind of, they're all kind of roughly done, except oh, I for see what you're doing. Yeah. all the the very back one here. It's really hard to get out with that stud there. Okay. So. Uh, all right. Well, there's no point getting crazy until we've actually ground the valve seats. So yeah. That'll be next. Mm -hmm. We're uh, on a late night mission to the uh, GCFCE to pick up uh, some top secret parts for the Buick. I guess the cylinder head is not really very top secret. There aren't really very many top secret parts on a car like this. It's a uh, turn up the base special preview. Have to catch it in some sunlight. Right? It's, uh, we'll be back with more turn up the base when the sun comes up. This is turned all the way, like the knob's broken. <laughs> turn up the base and break off the knob. So you snuck it into the office and got her cleaned up? Yeah, threw her in the, in the wash tank. Well, that really came back. It's just going to be so much nicer to work on. It was great. Well, It's a thousand times better than what it was. Oh, it's so good. It, that's good enough. It's going back together. Like, that's fine. That is awesome. That's saved hours and hours and hours. Where's the valvo holdo? 
Oh, they're in the back seat. Okay. Do you want to grab them off the floor, Paul? Go down like that. Okay. That could have gone so much worse. She's in. She's good. Oh, that's going to be great now. I'm tempted to leave the plugs in, honestly. <laughs> gap them, like Jim said. Yeah, <laughs> Just, gap, yeah, well, what if we break one off? You know what I mean? Yeah, you don't have to start After the way stuff. that valve came out, like, we'll replace them if they need replacing. Or we can even test them. But I guess you could test them while they're in the If we break one more thing on this engine, I'm it's pushing okay. it off a cliff. <laughs> yeah, like, it's going... <laughs> Uh, You'll have to drive it to a cliff. There's left to break. We'll have to tow it to a cliff. <laughs> and then push it off. What a monster. Well, that's a huge help. What? Dean! Hey! What's up, buddy? Packard time, Pack, eh? Packard time again, yeah. Uh, you got all right. Shirt on. August, yeah, Pack, Packard time. Packard uh, team uh, captain is August? on the scene. What are we, sometime in August here? August 29th? Yeah, wow. is it really? Is right? Damn, no. we better hurry. I want these things running. Been well, the Buick team is uh, putting it together here. So. Yeah, I know. Good for them, man. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah I, screw I those guys. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's right. Yeah, it's the hell with them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but uh, just gonna follow along here. Right. Steven's been doing a Steven's massive been, amount of cleaning yeah. here. This is all actually starting oh, to look oh, decent. Look at the sun shining on it. And the wow. sun is coming out. It's not a bad day. This is a great day. Let's get yeah. as much as we can. Yeah. Uh, so today's so plan. What do you think? We finish cleaning up the engine, and then I'm gonna dress the valves. We'll dress the seats. Yeah. And then we start reassembling. Start reassembling the valve train anyway. Yeah. Does everybody got enough beer and darts? Yeah. All right, it's coming. <laughs> okay, good. Let's get at her, okay. gentlemen. We just kind of give it a quick tidy here. And uh, can we get a close up of these guys? Let's see if it'll work. Uh, the valve seats are not terrible, but I don't think they're going to seal. Some of them are quite rusty. Yeah, if we look at that guy. That's quite poor, so uh, got very little chance that that's going to make very good compression. So if only we had some kind of machine for grinding valve seats. Do you need oh, to bring one? yeah. Damn, buddy. <laughs> uh, yeah. From the darkest uh, recesses. Use, yeah, that's... I haven't used this <laughs> since I got my uh, rototiller going. I think. <laughs> cool, eh? This is the Sioux Valve and Seat Grinder, uh, made in Sioux City, Iowa. Albertson uh, and Company. Yeah, this is a really nice quality tool, uh, donated years ago by my friend John, and uh, it, with everything that we need to do the job. Including this rotor. Including a rotor <laughs> for some other car, we don't know. Um, look at that. Oh, oh so cool. Yeah. Old compound even still. Nice. Got all of our various lapping tools. Yep. We got uh, all the different wheels for different sizes, both coarse and fine for finishing. If you lift that out yeah, there, sure. sir. Let's look and, see. and there's the business end of it. And even a, uh, oh, a stone dressing wow, jig. Yeah. That, wow. So we can dress the stones to get a nice 45 on everybody. Sweet. And. Uh, yeah, these are the little guides that you put into your valve guide to uh, keep the uh, stone square to the to the seat and some extra stones there. And there's the tool here. This works really well, but it's pretty haywire. It's pretty high speed. And I think for the purposes of what we're doing, we're going to just sub in a cordless drill for now because we uh, this thing I've used it and it's pretty it's pretty on or off, it's pretty it? on or off <laughs> yeah and uh, just might be a little more friendly to use a cordless drill at this point so uh, yeah pretty excited let's give it a try here and try okay, to grind well, some seats sweet. should be is it 11 over 32 11 there over it is 32. That's okay good. beauty we'll do all the exhausts this okay. is the stone that we'll use for the exhausts Oops. Boy, look at that. Look at that. Fits That's nice. nice, yeah. Oh, did you get her loosened up? Oh, yeah. Great. Now you give that a little turn. I'll tighten. Okay. Just a little, just a little crank just to snug there it up, go. right? Get yeah. her in there nice. That's sweet. Now it just has to sit down all the way without. Yep. Yeah. No, it's sitting there up. nice. Perfect. Great. Okay. Oh, so there you go. There's your, your, your you cordless drill build. adapter. Get my cordless drill adapter going. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah, this is about a quarter of the speed that that other thing goes. You go to China. That's better. Oh, look wow. at that. Wow. 
That's great. Hey. Yes. Well, we little could little use more. a little more. Oh, a little yeah. more. We'll yeah. do a little more on there. Yeah. It's okay. Better to sneak up. A little pressure going too. So how far is this driveway? We gotta drive this thing. Right. It's like we're getting pretty fancy. The driveway, here. yeah. Comes with the driveway and that. We're gonna be going to Oh, battery died. I'll go get another battery. What do you think of those? Those look great. Woohoo! Does yeah. that ever look good? Yeah, that's terrific. Uh, all of the uh, pits and rust. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Uh, you're, you're talking. All of the pits are gone. They were not that deep, and a quick grind. We really got to clean up this uh, yeah. lifter area here. We can do that now. Actually, we can do that next. Yeah, we can start doing that while I clean up the valves. Maybe the old Packard engine still to yet to find anything really other than good news since we started. This uh, engine has been uh, kind of a treat and really fun to, to learn about it. We also noticed we got one head stud that's backed out a bit, so oh, we'll yeah. have to put that guy back. Yeah. yeah uh, has everybody got yeah, enough beers? Uh, yeah, beers. Yeah, beers. we're just missing a couple of team members. <laughs> yeah, the, yeah, there's and some pizza. more. For sure, keep, I'm gonna keep going on it. Okay, you get cleaning and I'll, uh, I'll clean up the valves. Get some clean rags too? And... You bet, we got lots. Mm -hmm. These are some of the valves that came out of the Packard engine. And even after cleaning, I think it's pretty obvious that these are not going to run or seal in their current condition. So They're not perfect. That's pretty crusty. We're pretty generous with stuff, but I'm not going to bother putting that in. Unless we had a valve grinder and we could grind them up. So that's what we're going to try next. We're going to dress up uh, all of the Packard valves and then uh, we'll lap everything in and see how she goes. So let's uh, have a quick tour of the grinder. This machine here, that's where your valve goes. Sure. There's 45 there. 45 is what we did the seats at and usually you do the valves at 44, right? I'll believe you. Oh, look at that, eh? Got a quick release, there which is go. a nice sure feature. It is. Yeah, it's all part of the same the same, same, same group. Kit. Hmm. Okay, and then you just psh, psh, across, right? True. And there's a tool for dressing the stone if we have to, which is over here. Which I'm hoping I don't think we need to dress it. We really just need to grind the rust off of these things. That's they're so long. I'm a little worried about even a, a quarter of a degree is going to give us this. Mm -hmm. So we might, I might be shimming with paper if they're so long. I'm going to turn it Let's on. Let's try it. Ready? Okay. Now this rotates the valve. Look at the run out. It's no good. Just too much run out. Hmm. Now let me just check something. Maybe even try and rotate it yep. and see if oh, that's that better. solved it. Yeah, yep, there you that's go. Better. That's a hundred. That's as good as I could ever hope. Those are fine. Okay, good. Okay, now and we just bring that out till it starts to drag. This light work, wouldn't that be nice? Oh, oh, look at that. Yeah. Oh, that's even better. So, we're just going to come right out to touching. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. How much do we need? Oh, we still got <laughs> rust there. Oh yeah, we got to keep going. Yeah, yeah. we got to keep going for sure. That's a ah, That's funny. That's good. That's what it's for. I'm just so happy to have a use for the thing, you know? Stuff sits around. Look 
at that. Let's take a look. Oh, that's fine. Where's the rough spot? Right there. Right there. That's uh. No, it needs a little more. There's still some pits. Yeah. That's okay. We, well. we got so much margin yeah. left. We're we not may in as well. Yeah. Start running out of margin. That'll definitely seal them out. Oh yeah, she'll run. That's it, I think. Yeah, go we'll a little more. Go a little more. We yeah. still got lots of room. <laughs> Great machine. Yeah, doesn't it do a beautiful job saving all this crusty old garbage? I think That's that'll it. run. I agree. Yeah, yep. that looks really good. Pretty good. Okay, what yeah. do we got? 16 more to do? 15? 15 more. Okay, let's do it. That cleaned it yeah. up just fine. Cleaned up really nice. Okay. Try one more exhaust. What are we down to? Three or four left? Pretty fancy. We're back from uh, dressing up the valves, Dean. And oh, huh. you've got this all clean. It looks awesome, buddy. Okay, well, I think what I'm gonna do is uh, I'll start lapping in. Uh, we're gonna start with number one exhaust here and just see what kind of a pattern we get. Sure. I hope we get something reasonable. What are we looking for? About a sixteenth of an inch of gray in the oh, middle of the sure. seat, right? <laughs> yeah. We're looking for anything. Let's not kid ourselves <laughs> here. I got an exhaust. You got some nutties. Dean, how you doing there, buddy? Check out, check this out. Original gray. Oh blog, wow! Right? Look at that. Nice. Look, look at that line. How Good nice job. that is. You've done you've done some work. Well, here today. yeah, you put in some work. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe maybe he was feeling the heat after. Oh really? After Were doing, you feeling bad, Dean? Yeah, feeling the heat. <laughs> oh, are we pushing on the valve? Of course uh, we're. We need to we got to do a rotation. Oh, here. Okay. All right. Okay. Pop that guy. Smack in her here. down. Oh, Beauty. that's oh, nice. a nice sound. That's nice. Dean, are you excited? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I just love this car. Really? It's not like you. <laughs> yeah. I didn't think you were a car guy. <laughs> yeah, right? Listen to that. Oh, oh, that's nasty, eh? That's okay. Oh, it's good. Oh yeah. See how it's getting better. Yeah, you go up and down. Up and down, up and down. See? Gary? Oh. No, it's not speeding all day in here either. Who's got a rag? Uh, no, you might Any, need some new ones. Those Any, are pretty yucky. That okay. Just looking for a stripe. It's pretty stripey. Nice racing stripe near the top. Yeah. That'll be fine. Pretty wide. Nice. That's that's fine. Okay. Why don't we do a fine and then we'll call it? Right, we'll just give her the nice polish. Gonna say. What are we doing here? Oh, that's a runner. Oh, yeah. That is that is massive compression all day. That's gonna run just fine. Oh, yeah. This is the weakest guide too, and it's not even bad. Weakest guide. So uh, 
no need to put them in yet, so I'm just going to put this back. Okay. Confirmation that valve job is well on its way. Yeah. Couldn't really be happier with that. So. Wow. Good. Well, we'll keep going. Yeah. Why not? Takes seven seconds. Yeah. Okay. Dean, you having yeah. fun? Yeah. You hungry? Uh, not bad. You? Yeah, I'm hungry. I'm always hungry. You know. <laughs> Oh, what a sweetheart. What a nice puppy. Are you a nice puppy? Oh, yeah. You're a good girl. Actually, everybody gets a fair amount of abuse around here. Do I get my share, you guys? Things are really looking up because we're moving on to the starter. What is going on? Is it really tight? Oh, you're making your own impact wrench. Yeah, pretty much. Can you get at it from there? Like with some oil? Do we have oil? I thought we lost that privilege. Oh, oil. I know. No, oh, we, are we out of budget? No well, more oil? we got nutties. Come on. Are, you know, are we serious here? Get some nutties on that. Nice. Okay. Okay. There. Uh, we're going to need some nutties to install the valves, too. Okay. Everything is lapped in. Uh, everything looking pretty decent. Time to start reassembling. So we're going to rinse each uh, port as we go. And then we're going to kind of lube up the valves and grab all the clean springs and keepers. Dean, the keeper of the keepers. Yeah, they're there. Look at, he's but got just, all the parts. But we they're got not a regular like, assembly line going here in the middle of the night. Yeah, but they're not like perfect, you know? Yeah, have you seen the car though, Dean? <laughs> Hang on a second. Yeah, oh, that's the same car, buddy. Yeah, I know. So, it's not perfect. We were just talking about how good this motor would be in a boat. <laughs> like a Chris Craft? Like a wicked old wooden boat. Yeah. yeah. Why don't you buy a nice one? They are. Then we'll uh, use this one for I parts. should be then real. I keep yeah. The engine for a speed boat. I should perfect. be team captain and actually buy an ice pack today. Dude, if we get a million views, we'll force well, Dean. I Dean will buy. Dean will buy a Packard. I'll huh? buy this one this is you. a piece of. I'll pay you money. No, no, no. Buy a decent one. How's she look? Damn. Look at this thing. Look at you, it doesn't man. even look bad. Jeez, that's great, man. Oh, that's really good luck. Packard team getting pretty lucky. Yeah, here. Your transmission's got to be. The transmission will be <laughs> chunk. Yeah. Oh, also, damn it. I will not yeah, have no, team we're getting. Yeah, Team I, Buick I will is... not have it. <laughs> right? No, we're doing our best, though. I mean, those guys have already got... They, I mean, they're coming up hard. Like, it looks like we're winning team. on the Team Packard front. <laughs> you got to go to <laughs> Dean Superstore. Yeah, Come right. <laughs> Man, if this was a chicken commercial, you'd do 10 takes. The Popeye's chicken? I have that yeah. video, you know. Popeye's? Yeah, it's you great. You see it? Oh, I love it. Man. Oh, man, do you think they'd care if we put it in the video sometime? <laughs> you wanna, I'm sure we could somehow, you know. I don't think they're going to care. We could try to figure it out. Maybe Popeyes would sue us. Yeah, they might actually. Or give us free chicken. Or maybe we'd get some free chicken out of the deal. <laughs> we either get sued hey. or we get free chicken. Popeyes location would open in Northwest Edmonton in 2017. Take a look. How's this thing going? <laughs> look at that. That's a beauty. That thing's in great shape. That is, what a score. What do you want to use for grease here? Uh, let's use the sticky. I don't know, you're the guy. Whatever we got that's sticky. Wow, this is, this is open. So it was stuck out. And those are the, the uh, up front. It was stuck in the up position. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because it was but stuck not, in that up position, you couldn't push it down enough to get the snap ring out to get it all apart to actually right fix it. So this is that the starter was. overrunning clutch. Yeah. Uh, great. And it seems to be usable. Seems I mean, good. It should. It should be. Now that this works, that was the issue. Oh yeah, now, oh, look at that. So you need some oil so or was what, stuck. was it just stuck? Well, it was stuck right here. Okay, there, that's the best light we're gonna get on that subjecto. Okay, okay. Viewers, put your shades on. Hey, okay. yeah, it's harsh. It's not very nice lighting. Hey, we're putting valve keepers in. Okay, so here are the keepers. Are they greased? They're greased. Nice. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be it's easy times. Yes, sir. What? I felt that. Never heard that nice click. Seems 
promising. Absurdly easy, in fact. Once you oh, careful. You want me to back that up? Cool. Yeah. There you go. I'm pushing. Yep. And I'm abandoning ship. Oh, okay. Then therefore I am too. Wow, that's uh there, that, that was, was how that's how we want these to easy. go. Wanna have, let's give me the next one. Okay, the valve is there if you want to grease it. Every valve is going back in the hole it came out of, so I'm not really anticipating a bunch of bullshit. They're all just smoothly sliding in and out. I mean everything is just nicey nicey. Life's pretty good over here. It's all pretty clean over here, yeah. Look at that, eh? Man, remember how hard those were to get out? Look at Just perfect. So what we gotta do, you gotta seat it there. So this little, the top one goes on the little boss very, there. Very. And then you just go in there and push the whole works up till it's well out of the way. There. And then you get your keepers, which are Ready and greased. You put your fingies in there. Get those digits. And you slide things around. At some point you should hopefully land in the groove. And then you get to undo it with your fingers in there. Holding and hoping that it doesn't come unglued. At a certain point you have to just abandon ship and hope that they stick. Any rags? Oh, Brand new. <laughs> okay. Those ports look fantastic. So the valve spring's in there? No, it's not. Do we have a valve spring? Dean, we need an exhaust set. Yeah, yeah, it's here. Exhaust. Yeah. Well, you don't want to go crazy, Gary. <laughs> Just a little bit. Stop using my name. Oh. I don't want anyone to know who I am. Okay, everyone knows <laughs> you anyway. That's it. That's all we need to do, Gary. Oh, sorry. <laughs> No, I can't stop. No worries, no, I can't stop. <laughs> if we don't get that starter working, everything else is a waste. Well, just a shot before uh, before I drop all of this in the dirt again, and then <laughs> say I'm not cleaning this uh, and worry. just put it together anyways. There you go. Okay, and go. This is like the army putting your gun together. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it, Steve. Gotta beat the clock. And, uh, a towel nice. Oh, I got well, this had to oh, come yeah. apart, but I was looking at that. It's yeah. like that doesn't have to come apart, but it can. And I was, I tried for about three seconds on that snap ring, and then I'm like, nope, this is fine. Is it? Yeah, we're not. Yeah, that's gotta be a Jim Turbo Mustang. Uh oh. See, that's the issue. Here. Yeah, what's going on, Jim? Midnight oil, eh? Yeah. Lone Buick member. It doesn't happen by itself, man. Oh, really? That's what we've been trying. And... <laughs> what's going on, Dean? Hey, buddy, not much. How are you doing? <laughs> hey, pretty good. I haven't seen you in ages. Okay, that was a long time, man. Yeah. Yeah, working all the time. Then we're going to break. But now it's time to take a break. Okay. It's vacation time now. Are you on vacation? Well, soon. Great. Take it easy. Well, I'm just wiping off some of this dew here that's sitting in. <laughs> Rusting it. It'll be locked up as fast as you can get to it. Yeah. We're going, we're whistling her together here. Everything's looking pretty good. A lot of cleaning. And uh, there's your uh, my rig. There's your setup. setup. But a regular not, uh, assembly line here. Kind not of. Bad, yeah. Yeah. Not bad, uh, yeah. Once you get kind of a system, okay. We're good. See, Team Buick does it differently. They show up one at a time. Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah. Kind of, uh, <laughs>
piece wise, kind of more of a coach built approach. That's right. Yeah. How's the Datsun performing? Yeah, not too bad. We we're, we're building nope. another engine for it. Oh I really? Okay, this one's too fast. Yeah, you want something no, more it just leaks everywhere. Hammer? So you know, okay. isn't that what you do? Oh no, no, with the Mustang, you just continually dump oil into it and uh, hope it finds its level someday. Well, I guess that's the beauty of well, living in the country. You can kind of really well, it, ignore it, massive I, oil leaks. I can for ignore it part. too, for sure. I remember when I worked at the office there. It's like three spots where I parked, and you could tell exactly. Hey, Jimmy, <laughs> spot. Hey. Team Buick at a definite starter disadvantage at this point. Their foul and seized, rusty, uh, but similar also a Delco unit. Nice. Well, that's their problem. Let's check the, uh, let's do the Packard starter. We gotta do a test. Packard week four, really pretty satisfying. We're gonna go test fire the starter. Okay, let's take it up there. Special. Ready? Let's try it out. Nice. Beauty. Does it go back? Nice. Yeah, there's. It's odd. There's no solenoid on it like the uh, the other one. So my next thinking is how. Do we need to take this outside and blow all this out through here and there? Because if we put all the valves in, then all of like oh, there's yeah. so much crusty grossness yeah, yeah. in here. Are you gonna touch these up with that stone? Oh yeah. Wanna do that before you blow it out? Let's see what we think. They always want to go with the grain of the head. <laughs> they want to do a fine piece of wood. Right. Put some water on it to raise the grain, <laughs> cut it down one time. Oh, that'd be nice. Just shellac it and lay that gasket on there. <laughs> when you're sanding too much in this region, it's going to be low. It's going to be low. It's Ten thou right. low. Ten thou. You said you made a tool. A closer inspection, it looks like it's a drill bit with yeah, uh, some sandpaper. Oh, is that the uh, tool custom? Tool. <laughs> what would you call it then when you take something and you combine it in such a way that it does a job for you? Oh, I don't know, just a apparatus. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do we got yeah. to soak that down with? Varicella or what to? Yeah, I would say. Here, I'll show you how I was getting it here. Oh, uh, I don't know. I was kind of getting it spinning so that it would lead itself in. Oh yeah. There you go. Yeah. Okay, now we need to get, I don't know, we can do whatever we want, right? It's yeah, you're show. the inventor of the tool, so you're kind of the, uh, I'm kind of, you got free creative spirit of what the, this is not how what it's I, supposed to be used. This is not how I envisioned this. A pipette would be nice. <laughs> A pipette. <laughs> Gain hood more uh more. Of this thing together, right? 
halfway through that. that it didn't do it. No, it's hard to paint, but it all. I think we can be very happy with that. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> really starting to shape up here. Kind of looked like a piece of shit before. <laughs> oh, look at this. Also, the Buick gets a new stone. Hmm? Yeah, well, well, good, well the Packard so had to use the rough. <clears throat> high performance unit. We do you and your overhead uh, valve technology. Oh yeah. The head gets a new stone and I get nope. a new beer. Win-win. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sounds like a good plan. There's a... Touch up here. Oh wow! Yeah, like there. Oh yeah. Look at how nice that is now. There's no reason to not just stop there, right? Oh, yeah, I, would... I wouldn't go much further. Okay. And then the next guy, when it seizes up in 30 years, yeah. and he has to do this all over again. He's got a little meat to work with. He's got. Something. Yeah, you want to leave something for the next guy to work oh, with. That's yeah, the key yeah. to remember, That's right? right? Exactly. Pay him yeah. back for what he's gonna have we, to work with. We take block. only memories and leave only footprints. <laughs> recess valve seats. Yeah. yeah. What the heavy actual... recess valve seats and some <laughs> questionable <laughs> guides, maybe. <laughs> oh, I'm really glad to see this. I thought it was such a complex. Process, yeah, it's nice that it's just like a back alley. It's very real. Uh, yeah. The guy, what did you can see? A guy that would just do these all day on his oh, bench. Yeah. Right? Oh, here comes Mr. Smith again. Maybe you get another... some of that uh, that real hokey '50s stuff where you like hook up an electric motor to your wheel and use that to run the transmission to turn a crank or whatever, and just grind one throw. Those things, you just drop the pan and just yeah, Joe's garage. Oh, and just, that, uh, yeah. Put in one off-size bearing or whatever. That would be ideal. Yeah, we need all of the used car lock tools. <laughs> Big pail of sawdust for differentials and transmissions. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute, you got some sawdust available? I might need some here in a little bit. Yeah. We may have to sawdust up that transmission. Oh, nice, yeah. 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 Ooh, quiet. 400,000 K, but it sure don't drive like it. <laughs> Drives like new. Yeah. One owner. Like banana peels in like a diff or transmission. That's I've heard of that diff, yeah. It seemed but... extremely hard to do, like fucking poking banana peel to the hole. Yeah. Even sawdust would be a pain. What was the idea behind that? Oh, well, just to it, take up some of the backlash in the gearing. Add some filler to the oil. Yeah, yeah. Like thicken it up a touch. Yeah, yeah so there's no whirling or just nice and smooth. Not just anything fibrous, banana husk, or <laughs> coconut <laughs> shell. Oh, yeah. Depending nuts. on your climate. <laughs> yeah. Dirt. Uh, just anything really. Wow. Wind it right up. Yeah. Oh yeah, make that right will be work. Try that. Cool. Oh, man. Now we have a much bigger surface to present to. Good, yeah, to offer up. Um, Perfect. Just a little bit of it. Yeah. What do yeah, you need? Yeah. Uh, just one of these suction cuppers here. Yeah. And you got some goo there. Did you get some? Uh, on the thing, you, you grease this thing here or what? Here, water or whatever. Dr. Cover, beer. Yeah, that. See here. Put a little grease on her here. Her neck, random. She was actually alright. But she was the one that people were kind of drainage and shit. Let's see like, here. Has a separate finger here to avoid cross contamination. Oh yeah. How's it working? Is that one gonna hmm. spin? Should here. Let's see here. Ooh, that oh, feels nice. nice. Hey? Just get my hands cleaned up here. It's like the years of Boy Scout training. 
Well, you can hear it get better and better. Yeah, yeah. Well, and if you lift it up, then it resets. Then you're back on course again. Because now mm. you've got fresh material in there, right? So you can go for <laughs> do it three or four passes and then have a look. Oh man, it's real size on size here. Yeah, do you want a smaller? Uh, Is there a smaller one? Yeah, there's one here. Can't vouch. Uh, no? Looks to be the identical size. Um, oh, there's a real small guy here. No, oh, it looks like it's been I think you're, uh, compromised here. Yeah. I don't think it's going to fly. Is your Damn. rubber glue. Well. Oh, that'd be perfect. Hey? Oh, that's... oh fuck, it just <laughs> cancels down the twist. The gray ribbon, yeah. Can you see okay. it? Yeah. Oh, damn. A little well, sparse that's... in some areas, but... You think? Uh, that's good enough. Oh, yeah, I think it's good enough. Yeah, I think so. Okay, perfect. Okay, you want we'll the next uh... one? Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Gray stripe. Perfect. Let's... Oh, sure, right? Yeah, that's right work. downtown. Oh, yeah. For some crusty old junkers. I mean... Oh, good, I'll suffer it through another that's intake. That's pretty decent. Oh, you'd be hard-pressed to get better than that anywhere else. Valve lapping continues. Nice. Pretty happy with that. What do you got? That out. What a good girl. I'm gonna go on to, and then oh, yeah. that's it. One more to go, and then we're gonna rinse it out, start putting it together. Good. Back on the winning side of things here. Yep, this is a huge part of this job sorted. The last couple to do here. Yeah, I have two <sighs> cylinders. This might be one of the more extensive rebuilds we've tried without taking the plugs out. Oh yeah, I think this uh, really tops it. Really trying to cut the hours to a bare, bare minimum. Oh yeah. Right? Yep, this all went surprisingly well. And much easier to work inside with these fancy valve in head types. It's trying to get good at this. Yeah, too bad there's only a couple left. Yeah, I'll have to get a few more. You have eights to do here. Girl, borrow the rag. <laughs> the rag. <laughs> oh. Lean manufacturing. Lean. The Japanese yeah. have adapted this, believe it or not. <laughs> One rag for about three or four workers. The waist is down about three and a half percent. <laughs> oh. Nice. And they found that sharing the rag built camaraderie between the workers as well. They talk to each other instead. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and they can eliminate the water cooler. <laughs> that also it's saved about save two and a half points on the whole operation. Wonder how long he'd last if he set up a fucking <laughs> valve grinding shop and yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, eh? <laughs> Valve grinds de coking. New vehicles don't smoke though. They and when they do I think they're destined for the scrap heat. They're already done, yeah. <laughs> No Buick Enclave, it's just even a big blue haze. <laughs> yeah, right? Try taking it in, you yeah. have the valves quickly ground. It's hard starting, it's yeah. a little weak compression. <laughs> it's got a smart hard it starting, it. yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're in there. Yeah, nothing is really hard starting apart from battery problems these days. Yeah. Yeah. Just start until one day you don't. Yeah. The communal towel, please. Oh yeah, I'm just trying to oh, clean the... my hands off of it. Jesus. This system seems awfully biased in favor of management. Oh yeah. It's really nice. Yeah, looking decent. And uh, not fantastic. Oh, looks pretty good. good. Get a load of the shirts, so. though. Oh yeah. Uh, thanks to our buddy Phil for the sweet shirts for Phil. Team Buick. 
Because we can't just have Team Packard having the only shirts. Oh, exactly. So that was very common. Yeah, Buick owners aren't schlubs. Like we're... Try not to laugh. We're pretty high highfalutin. Look at this, eh? That looks like an engine again. Yeah. Starting to. Ah. Is it in? Yeah. Up here. Like you really didn't clean your hands anymore. It no, gets it smears, it around. smears it around. Yeah. Well, that is not a total disaster. That could have went much worse. Like the okay, keepers flying around. And well, we didn't have a single misfire. I'm dropping it in the dirt. No. And finished with. Years and time to spare. So overall, not a terrible uh, repair on that. Real smashing success. The interesting intake valve with the little swirly port there. Oh yeah, it's real pain to the, laugh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so that's, I think, part of the fireball design anyway. We'd still be cleaning. Oh yeah. So we got the and whole thing done disgusting. in just the time it would have taken to clean it. And yeah, there's actually literally rusty valve springs, eh? Yeah. But like, luckily there's two dual valve springs. So when that one just fractures. Yeah, uh, it'll, we'll just have to keep the revs down yeah, a bit. Quick. Some of that old North Dakota fucking fine sand, eh? Yeah, this mm -hmm. car was a gravel road car, I think, at some oh, yeah. time. Eh? Only those were a couple of gold flecks. <laughs> old gold miners car <laughs> yeah, <there you> go. <laughs> just pounded up the old gold trail <laughs> yeah probable history <laughs> if I had to guess <laughs> if I had to guess it was an old gold miners car <laughs> I think we can be pretty satisfied with that oh yeah for a uh, driveway runner certainly didn't make it worse so that's a no that was some ugly stuff yeah, it's nice. pretty raunchy looking in there. Next is clean up the rocker shafts and then hopefully, what did you say, next week the... Yeah, yeah, next Tuesday, the uh, gasket kit will be here. Which, yeah. which one do you think would be actually faster? Well, it'll be this Buick right off the line. That yeah, fucking yeah. automatic's just gonna fucking be wondering what's happening. <laughs> it won't know <laughs> what's going on. Eh? Oh, fuck. This thing's gonna yeah. have, uh, as soon as it touches, it's gonna spin one tire and <laughs> just fucking yodel on ahead. So we just literally need rings after this to show off. Well. Yeah, you ordered those, right? Yeah, they should be here. Well, probably after the long weekend. We'll be yeah, there, good. So. Uh, Jim said the gasket set will be here too. Okay. So that's awesome. Get this thing going after the long weekend. Yeah, uh, I would like to see uh, the start going back together now, which is fun because we've been taking them apart for that's a while. That's a big head, hey? Isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's a big head. Oh, you know what you might take if you think you have a chance? Do you think you could sneak the uh, rocker shaft into the parts washer? Uh, yeah. I'm taking a bunch of oil there Sunday. Today's episode is sponsored by Coffee and Darts. Coffee and Darts. What do we got here? That's all your bolts. So we don't need to put that in the parts washer. Those will just force. Do you want to take this to the truck now then? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Show me all the posh options, buddy. Well, we got uh, dog dish hub caps for Night, starters. Of course, yeah. Uh, gleaming, yeah. gleaming factory paint. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's got Rubber. all of the base options. It does have a radio. Oh, yeah, it's got the radio. Yeah, um, not even intermittent wipers. Check it out, just low Just high. two speed wipers. 89 has intermittent wipers. Oh, yeah, mine's an LE though, but look at that, eh? Woo <laughs> it's so big. Hey, okay, she's rubber floors. Uh, it's got a rear slider and a radio. And, yeah. Uh, Base that, upholstery. An automatic transmission. That's the three options that was checked off on this. Yeah, day. automatic slider and radio. That's it. That's it. <laughs> the message center says. 
this thing is pretty base. What used to go here? That's the clock and stuff. Cargo lamp. Oh, the clock. Oh, on the older oh, ones, no. yeah. What would that be? Yeah, I don't Ca know. Overdrive off when they had overdrive and the cargo light. Oh, when okay. They had, when they had a cargo light. Nice. But you had the option for that. Well, pretty clean. Where did this come from? Buck and a half kilometers. It was an Alberta government truck and then a lady in Calgary had bought it. Drove it for a few years and then... Yeah, hey. That's how you know you're getting the good stuff. Ex-government base stuff. I love how it doesn't even have the chrome trim around the taillights. I guess the it's, it's like they make sure you know it's a little extra base, right? They <laughs> yeah, take the chrome right. out. Take the chrome off the tail. Yeah. Gray bumper. Yeah. No like no trim. No no moldings. No two tone. Three nine. Frankers, do you like it? Frankers pretty much approves. 3.9 liter. Let's have a look at the plant. Is this the 318 with the front two cylinder or yep. back two cylinders cut off? And it's a dog. Like it is. <laughs> Where's the rest of it? Look at those belts, hey? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I see you got the. Oh, I'm on the run to fail on the belts too. Like who cares? It's got two of them. So yeah, that's what I mean. Plan. When one goes, then you start shopping. Yeah. And then. Uh, I probably have the belts for it, but then I'd have to look. Yeah. It does have daytime running lights, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah this is newer than mine. Because it's got the, the modern grill. And, uh, yep. so a bit of a whiskey dent in the side there. What in the hell? Somebody's door came into that pretty hard, eh? So what division of government was this? I have no idea. I don't know if it would have been... Parks, uh, maybe? You'd think Parks would have a four-wheel drive, though, but maybe not. Maybe not. Not for just taking camper tickets. Or like you had the lawnmowers behind, you know, when you see the lawnmowers behind the city of Edmonton truck and stuff. Oh, yeah. It could have been a lawn maintenance vehicle. <laughs> like, it's, it's got that base. kind of it's provenance. Yeah, yeah. We looked at the same one years ago with the five-speed in it that they had. Oh, yeah. And... It was out of our six hundred dollar price range back then. So. Yeah, this thing uh, pretty decent though. Hey. Yeah, you know what? The rockers are good. The floors are good. The fenders, well, fender. Yeah. Well, the other one would pop out. Yeah, it's pretty decent. Like I've definitely for a beater. Shit. It didn't even have the underneath mounted spare. It was right here. Okay. Yeah. But I mean, there's not a dent in that box. It's never no. done any hard work. No, this is probably the hardest this ever really worked. Yeah, all right. The the Lights on for safety. Yeah, thanks for a look at this sweet base Dodge, buddy. Always Rosin. fun to play a little turn up the base. Welcome to our Drossen. Here's your Dodge. Fit right in now. Yeah, now you're allowed to I'll be move, here. I've moved down from the police car option. This is a regular ah, Same old shit. Yes, 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 yes,
Yeah, Team Buke, what are you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. I wish him luck, but I mean, 